My name's Cedro. Well, I lived in Denton for a long time now, since I was, you know, uh, fresh out of high school. I moved over here from Argyle, which is right down the street. Actually, I went to Dallas first, to trade school, for close to a year, and then I came here. Characters, I've been doing them on and off for about three or four years, but I've only started coming here to the square since last summer. And I just came because I realized nobody else in town was doing it, and Every town, you know, major town, like, you hear about people setting up in the square doing stuff like this, characters, all kinds of stuff. And I figured, since nobody's doing it, I'll do it. It was, I think, a Saturday night. We were just kind of walking. I think we were going to go to LSA Burger. And then we saw him, and I was like, oh, that's really cool. So I told my boyfriend, hey, I want to get a cute caricature of us. I was out on the square, like, towards the beginning of the semester with some friends getting dinner. And um, we saw a sign that said free caricatures, so we decided to stop and check it out. I've been into art all my life. As long as I can remember, I've always liked to draw and paint and everything. I do all kinds of art stuff besides characters. My other favorite thing to do is spray paint art. I guess it just came to me, but I was inspired growing up by a lot of artists. Like when I came here, Bob Ross, you know, taught me how to paint. There was a, a guy named Mark Kistler that used to have his own show on TV that taught me a lot about how to draw. He was one of my heroes. And that's when I first started drawing cartoons, is when I was watching him on TV. I like to draw in black and white because it's like the, tra the traditional way to do characters, is black and white. But, and it's also quicker, which I try to be as fast as I can. But lately I've just been using Crayola markers because it's just what I have at hand, you know. And, <laughs> and really, I mean, they're really good markers for drawing and painting just because they have a stereotype, you know, the little kid stuff. but. A lot of professional artists actually use Crayola markers for drawing, people don't know that. I think it shows like how artsy Denton can be. My family's always been real supportive of me, of my artwork and stuff. Ever since growing up, they always knew I was going to be an artist. Denton is all about like the DIY scene, so I think that it's really good in the art field with it. Um, you know, there's always art shows, there's always um, film festivals, everything like that going on in Denton. So I think it was like a, like a little novelty item to add to the whole scene itself, especially like on the square where it's just like right there. I came out here just for the practice at first and, you know, just to do it. But now that I've come out, that I've been out here and I see the reactions of people, I really like it, you know. it's. It's a good atmosphere. I've met people out here that are my friends now that set up out here with me, you know, and I like it. 